check it out. This is called the energy stick. And I'm going to show you a couple of quick experiments that you can do with it that are fun and easy and teach you a lot. The first thing you'll notice is that it checks for conductivity. For example, my body is an electrical conductor, and so when I touch both sides of it, it activates. You can even check household items for conductivity. And even your fellow human. The device is triggered when a very small current is allowed to pass from one of the foil ends to the other. You can even trigger it with just a wire. You can even do experiments to measure the current. This time, instead of using my right hand, I'm powering it with a plasma globe. As the electric field of the plasma globe spreads through the air, it motivates a small current which activates the circuit. Notice inside the energy stick are three light-emitting diodes, red, green, and blue LEDs. But the diodes don't turn on all at once. Can you guess which color diode will turn on first? The answer? It takes less energy to generate red light than green light and blue. You probably already know that ultraviolet light is more energetic than violet light and similarly, blue light requires more voltage to turn it on. This is a lesson in modern physics and quantum mechanics. That is, it's not the brightness of the light, but the frequency, the color of the light that is important. Energy is in direct proportion to frequency, and blue light has a higher frequency than red light.